Are reform now more inclined to go after Labour voters than Conservative voters? I say that because I think Nigel has made that point. It's kind of quite J.D. Vanceian to sort of have this proposition where you are right wing in a lot of your socially conservative social policies and culture policies. You want to talk tough on immigration, but you might, in the vein, vein of J.D. Vance, be speaking more to the working man and women, say, for instance, when you're talking about factory closures, productivity, all of these green we're, ideas look, that are going to cost jobs in the absolutely. North Absolutely. We're, we're, the truth is we are the party of common sense, the party of the working class. Our e main economic policy, for example, is to pay no income tax until you're earning £20,000 a year, mm. uh, which would... Free up fifteen hundred pounds. That? That'll cost about forty billion. Forty and you, billion. And you pay for that by you pay for that. First of all, we shouldn't be paying voluntary interest on all the QE money. Yeah. Economists now agree with me on that. Although you calculated that figure when and, interest and when rates you last were five and a half percent. No, they were five and a quarter, and they're now five. And our numbers were based on less than five. What you challenged me on that on last time. How much less than five? Based on four and three quarters. Okay, of, but what if interest rates by the time of the next parliament go down to one or two percent? Then we get more growth. But the point is. We shouldn't be wasting that. It's costing All us right. billions of it. Um, if you scrap net zero, you save tens of billions every single okay. year. Well,